If you're an aspiring strategist, it can often be hard to find the right material to help you break into the industry. Let me give you the top 10 resources that are going to help you out on your journey. What you need is a roadmap, so I made this step-by-step -step guide to help you through the process. Consider this roadmap and the other tools and resources in this video to help you create your blueprint for the next six to nine months of your strategy career. Good luck and let's begin. For anyone who's looking to become a strategist, I've laid out the steps you should take in this six month strategy transformation plan. Your three main focuses should be to learn, connect and publish a work of your own. It's a quick LinkedIn read. All the links discussed in this video are in the description below. The next resource is a great read to understand the early stages of strategy or account planning as it was referred to back in 1974. The JWT planning guide was written by the godfather of strategy himself, Stephen King. This 37 page guide was created to help others in the 70s at JWT London understand the process of marketing and brand building. At present, it is used by junior strategists looking to understand the core of advertising planning. It is strong evidence that strategy fundamentals never change. Almost 50 years later, and it's still eerily accurate and incredibly applicable to the modern problems brands face this day. Find topics like an approach to planning advertising, advertising's contribution to marketing, implications for planning advertising, a framework for planning advertising, and the advertising planning cycle. The next deck is a sneak peek into the Strategy Finishing School content. The Day One Advice for New Planners from Old Planners is a collection of quotes and reminders from the smartest brains in planning. To give you knowledge bombs on what it takes to be great at your job, this is one of the first decks we made for the school's content. And up until today, the golden pieces of advice still help strategists, managing directors, and heads of department to be pointed in the right direction. I've also put a link in the descriptions if you're interested to learn more. Another free tool you can grab is the Deck of Brilliance by Julie Raminson and Todd McCracken. It's a helpful website that has 52 tools to help you generate ideas for your next project. They have the goal of simplifying our approach to client briefs and avoid leaving the outcomes to chance with a random thought. These tools are the result of over 50 years of experience in the world's toughest advertising markets, presented with actual ad examples with the most iconic brands around the globe. Choose limitlessly from 52 topics, watch the ads, spark ideas for your own work. How to write a brief that sets everyone on board. In this next tool, which is another deck from the Strategy Finishing School, are 10 examples of the Get Who To Buy Creative Brief. It has 10 campaign examples broken down into insights and their Get Who To Buy statements. In it are brands like Fujifilm, eBay, and Microsoft. Use this deck to enhance your brief writing skills. The Undercurrent Skills Maturity Matrix by Clay Parker Jones is a development tool designed to give strategists a clear path into the nine levels of their career. It's a matrix that identifies your role in research, communications, making, insights, presentation, manifestation, management, and counsel, according to the current level of strategy you're in. It helps strategists define and deepen their strengths and gives managers a way to guide juniors under their leadership. The next is a simple guide that you should use for telling a strategic narrative. If you can't put strategy into words, you probably don't have a strategy to begin with. There's this great article, Strategy Needs Good Words, written by Martin Weigel, which proves that strategy is a narrative, and just having a story to tell is putting strategy too plainly. It should be the art of persuasion and getting other people to do something. When you use the right words, your strategy will invoke curiosity and rigor from your audience. Weigel lists down 13 tips to follow to write a strategic narrative that will help you be good at words and persuasive. He is an advocate for planners to be good writers as well. So if you want to further improve your writing skills, this course from Pixar is something you should check out as well. Learn how story structure, characters, and visual contribute to an ad and everything behind it. Pixar in a Box, The Art of Storytelling is a short course offered by the Khan Academy. You're probably wondering, why is storytelling a big part of strategy? It's because a great story sparks ideas and connections. With a story, what you're really trying to do is get the audience to have the same feeling, making them more ready to be persuaded. It all comes back to getting people to do something. Did you know that Monsters, Inc. was pitched in a story not about monsters who scare kids, but about a man becoming a father? This is a really great course you should check out. 
The next resource, How to Do Account Planning by Mark Pollard. Mark illustrates this by an eight-step approach. He basically explains a hand-drawn doodle to simplify account planning and expose the truth about the overcomplication of strategy. It guides you on how a client brief is transformed into insights to the single-minded proposition, to the big idea, then finally the application of planning and how it affects the world. He introduces the concept of idea flipping to have a concise plan and iterates the importance of insights and a single proposition to lock in your strategy. You can also listen to the 2010 article in a podcast also released by Mark in June 2018, where he summarized further his account planning process that held up six years after and even until today. Lastly, in this list is the Strategy Finishing School. It takes you on a journey from the fundamentals all the way up to leading a strategy department. It is the sum of all my knowledge as a strategy consultant for leading brands like Uber, Facebook, Disney, and Snap, all in a single master course. It is a treasure trove of frameworks, tools, and templates that helped me sell in over $4.5 million worth of strategy over the last five years. If you want to gain more authority in your role at the agency, have confidence in your skills, crush your imposter syndrome, and to top it all off, be a part of a strong network of over 4,000 trusted planners, join by signing up. I'll put a link in the description. If you want to further your knowledge on some of the best resources you can read about strategy, I'll put a link to another bonus deck we use in the school, The Strategy Mate. The Strategy Finishing School members love it and I hope you'll find it useful too.